how to make hair rigs more flexible and smoother. There are multiple ways on how to rig hair, and some of them can even be combined. But I often use the deform path tool because it's more flexible. More flexible than Sophie Dossie. This of course applies to hair that are separated into parts. All you have to do is add some control points on the hair part. Pro tip, adjust the width of the deform path to your liking. You can find this option in the inspector palette. This is a matter of experimenting to be honest. Once you're done with that, we can now set the keyforms for the hair movement. We're gonna need two parameters for this. One for the hair movement and one for the swaying part. What's the difference? The hair movement parameter is the main reason why it's moving drastically, while the swaying parameter is just used for the little curl in the end of the hair for extra smoothness and flexibility. When you set the keyforms, don't forget to synthesize the corners. Otherwise, the hair wouldn't go all the way around. And just because we're quirky, we're gonna add the extended interpolation. You can set this to however you like. And you're done! What live 2D tutorial should I do next?